Welcome back, guys, for more Dawn of Man. It's awesome, isn't it? It really is. There's just no other... It's, it's a great game. Great game. There's, yeah, there are a few issues with the, with the UI that I've got, but other than that, it's pretty freaking awesome. We're going to try and improve our, our productivity a bit. And um, the way I'm going to do this is using the limits a bit more. So, for example, now this is something that I didn't know. Now, production. I've got a, produ I've got a production limit of flint um, of, of 15, right? So, like, if I go and tell them, for example, to go and gather flint, and let's say I go, I go and, and, and choose, like, six or ten resources, they'll go out and, and, and mine it or gather it until they reach that 15. And then all of these instructions are cancelled. I didn't realise that. So we can either set up a work area uh, to bring more of it in, or we can increase the limit, for example. Now, both are worth doing. So, for example, uh, uh, let's see. I want, uh, let's go to tribal vision. So we've got, like, um, that's copper. That's flint. Uh, oh, we've got a, couple of, got a couple of flint up here. Which, which might work. I wonder if I can get that third one in as well. If I, um, if I get, let's see, if I get uh, a work area for flint and crank it up to the max. Okay, now I've got one, two. Oh, I can get all three in. Sweet, that'll do. So I plop that in and I'll say, yeah, up to five people can work there. Now this is the same limit. This is the production limit, the same as in the limit screen. So let's crank that up to like, I don't know, like 30. Cool. So that'll start bringing that in. So that's um, that's my flint kind of sort of taken care of a bit better. Uh, let's have a look at some of the other limits because there's a there's a, a lot that we can we can improve on, I think. So for example, our animals. Production limit for these guys. Um, now currently I've got, let's see. I've got like 16 sheep, 16 pigs. I'm gonna trim these all back down to 10, right? And I'm gonna see if they'll automatically slaughter the animals for me, which I'm hoping they will. Um, it's F4, by the way, for, for the limit screen. Uh, so let's get, let's see, what do we want? Let's crank you up to 10 and... It's seven clicks to get up to 10. And donkeys. Yeah, 10, and you guys up to 10. All right, cool, so that's that. Then, um, now transport, transport you have to do them manual anyway, there's no auto production for that as far as I know, so I'm just gonna leave those as infinite, that's fine. Uh, tools though, for example. Now, currently, I'm manually creating the tools, but it gets to be a bit of a pain after a while. So like, I want like 50% of the, of the population to have sickles. So I'm going to set that to 50% of the population, right? Um, picks, maybe, maybe we have 25% have got picks so they can go and go mining. Um, I want, say, 75% to have bows and let's say 75% swords, maybe. Um, spears, actually, why don't we say like 50% swords, 50% spears, 50%, yeah. Uh, knives, Knives, let's say 75. Axes, again, maybe 50. Fishing tools, we only need about 25% of the population to have fishing tools. Right, so all of those are set. What I can now do is go to my crafter and I can say, okay, I want you to continuously produce bows up to that production limit, right? So I can say, there you go, continuously produce bows and uh, continuously produce sickles. Now, do I, the thing is, do I want flint sickles or do I want copper sickles? Well, to be honest, at this stage, copper's fairly valuable. So I think, I think we'll have uh, flint sickles. And we'll do the same over here. Boom, boom. Uh, what else do we want? We want axes. Uh, I'll have bone spears, uh, flint picks, flint knives. They've got the same over here, so picks, yeah, knives, bones, spears, bone harpoons, uh, flint axes. There we go. 
Right, so all of that stuff, and you can see that they're, they're starting to queue these items up. Uh, let's crank up, let's crank up the speed. So now, tools production should be, like, automated, which would be kind of cool. Awesome. Uh, pig has been slaughtered, sheep has been slaughtered. So I think they're going to get them down to the kind of range that we want. See, another one's gone. Two sheep have been slaughtered. Sweet, awesome. All right, now it's the spring. Uh, and I want to get this area over here. Whoops. I want to get this area over here planted up. Uh, if I possibly can. There's tons and tons of sticks all over the place. So let's see. Let's see if we can't get something else planted up. What, like, what do I want? Uh, maybe just some, I don't know, some grain. I mean, we are producing. The problem is we're producing tons and tons and tons of grain. But what I really want to produce is just straw. I don't know another way to produce straw other than to produce more crops. But we are producing crazy amounts of grain. So, yeah, but I, honestly, I don't know another way to produce it. So let's, um, I mean, I could produce more flax, I suppose. I think, I'm pretty sure flax produces, uh, produces straw. But I think I'm just going to slap in some corn over here. Um, yeah. Yeah, let's do it. What the hell? So let's get, I don't know, let's have uh, einkorn. So let's get, ooh, man. Let's try that again. Um, einkorn. So, oh, oh, I can, get a, I can get a full five by five in there. All right. So let's do a five by five there. Now I want somewhere to put the straw that gets created. Uh, I don't want to have, to have them carrying it all the way over to this side of the village, which is where all of the, all of the haystacks are. So let's just pop in storage. So a couple of, yeah, in fact, like maybe one. Let's just have a haystack over there. That'll do. Is that one of ours? No, that's a deer. All right, go. Awesome. High corn, set to high priority. Nah. Another sheep's been slaughtered. Four pigs have been born. So we're cranking out the pigs. But yeah, it looks like, say, no, two new sheep have been born. Oh, three new goats have been born. Sweet. So we're actually getting our, getting our goats up. Right, how are we doing? We're, we're at uh, 12 tech. Some of your people have no light clothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get to it. We'll get to it. We will get there. God, the vi village is busy, isn't it? Busy, busy, busy. Let's go back to the limits again. Uh, what else can we kind of sort out a little bit. So we've got a production limit for logs of 10. Um, let's crank that up to like 30. Um, 30 for stones, yeah, let's crank stones up to 30. That's infinite, that's infinite, that's fine. Now, dry skins, I've got that set to unlimited. Do I actually want that to be unlimited? Not really. Let's set it to like 40. Uh, leather I'm gonna leave as unlimited. Tannin. Let's maybe crank tanning up. Now I'm going to need more storage for this. It's the only problem. Um, let's see. Now production for wool. Again, do we really want that to be infinite? I don't think we do. I don't think we want it to be... Let's have like 30 wool in stock. And the same for linen. And then again, wool cloth. How much wool cloth do we really need? I'm thinking maybe 30 again. And the same with linen. 30. And then we've got charcoal. Charcoal 15. Let's have copper 15. Let's set all of these ores and these to 15. Cool. All right. So now clothing. Skin outfits. We don't want skin outfits at all now. Leather outfits. Oh, no. Uh, zero. There we go. And I don't want leather outfits. I just want wool outfits for 100% of the people and linen outfits for 100% of the people. Hooray! Now, bread. Let's crank bread up a bit. Let's have more bread being produced. We'll keep flour at 20, I think. Grain production. Now, again, grain. Do we want infinite production for grain? I mean, we probably do, I would think. Uh, but like meat, do we want infinite meat production? Or is there a point where 
it's like we don't we just don't need that much i'm thinking that we, we should reduce that to like say 50 or something um water i think water we actually want to increase let's crank that up to 50 what the hell is this oh this is beer oh man we want lots of beer let's have 50 uh this is milk milk should be unlimited all right cool so hopefully now things should be a little bit better but we've got no storage left so we need to increase our storage we've got 13 points of tech now let's have a look at the tech situation we, what we want to get to is masonry so that we can upgrade our storage to warehouses which would be a big improvement but we need a lot of tech for that yeah we're going to need about 30 for that so i think in the meantime keep going um, I've got we've got stables out there we could do we could just do with another storage but we've actually got a lot of storage already and the, the problem is that we've got like we've got like loads and loads and loads of bones and loads of logs and loads of sticks and stuff like a lot more than we actually need same with the wool so I think I'm gonna look out for a trader coming in and see if we can't unload some of this stuff would be kind of good got a storm coming in now no, speed it up um, I'm actually thinking I mean the, the problem is where could I build another storage there, there really isn't a lot of room anywhere um, now for sticks and stuff I mean th like th that's getting stored on these um, on these wood piles and I could certainly put in some more some more wood piles and stuff I mean, for example i wonder if we can put let's see storage see if we can put no it won't fit there uh, no it won't fit there i could maybe get some ah now we could put an extra wood pile there we can put an extra rock pile there helps maybe a little bit All right, cool. No storage spots left. I know, I know. I'm trying to do something about it. We're doing okay for uh, gr uh, for our granaries. We've still got a few spots left, but it is getting filled up with the grain, which is the problem. How we do it? Look, we've got 260 grain. Like, what the hell do we do with all our grain? But we are bringing in some some straw again. Which is good news. Let's see. How are we doing over here? We are... Yep, 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 yep. We've got straw coming in. So that's kind of good. Now we've got... One of our pigs. One of our goats. Awesome. Awesome sauce. So let's see. Wow. We've got so much stuff. We've just got so much stuff. Now, I have been asked in the comments by a couple of people to build like a second village which um which we definitely could do let's see how many cows have i got we're up to eight should we should we get a couple more cows yeah go on capture and and a young male there we go go awesome let's see if we can bring those in what are we up to we're up to 76 people which is our capacity at the moment i'm i will i, I will do a second settlement but Probably, probably not at the moment. Look at the look at the bone grain, but a straw is actually coming up a little bit. Seventy three straw. Guys, get it, get it collected. Get it on some of our haystacks. Where are they storing it? I don't know if they're even bringing it in at the moment, but they're bringing the grain in. But I, I, I think our granaries are going to be like overloaded pretty soon there is the, there is some room still left that one almost full room for nine in there so like another granary may be a good idea that one is virtually full it's it is the damn grain somebody died of old age i wonder like Like, seriously, what are you supposed to do with it all? <laughs> like, it's crazy. We've got loads of bread. Okay, so we're getting down to our levels of, like, 10 pigs, 10 sheep. We're at 10 cattle. 
Eight, we're up to eight donkeys now. Awesome. Oh, we've got a raider attack coming in. All right, cool. Let's tell people to get inside. Probably speed things up a little bit. So I'm guessing they're going to come down here across the... Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Move you. Move your donkey cart, quick. All right, they're across the bridge. Oh, he's sprinting in. Uh, let's close the doors, shall we? Yep, close the gates. Oh, the dogs. Oh, they killed one of our dogs. Yep, yep, we killed them. <laughs> yep, well, that's them sorted out. Right, let's get back to back to normal. Oh, uh, open the gates. Hooray. I've got that one opening out. Should be opening in. Not that it makes any difference whatsoever, but some people get really annoyed about that. Another sheep's been sort Right, so now we're down to our 10, 10, 10 kind of limit. Good. So we can actually control the balance of our livestock. That's awesome. We're up to 17. We can almost move into the Bronze Age. Oh, my Lord. How is our stock of straw? We're up at 70. We're moving into the winter. Oh, this is the best straw harvest we've had for ages. Have we actually got... Oh, my God. We've actually got straw in our haystacks now the question's gonna be can we get through the winter without completely exhausting our, uh, our straw no storage left again like what else is new let's crank it up to times eight let's get through the winter they're still bringing straw in by the looks of it we're at 64 I did see it go up a couple so we've got 10 straw there four straw there cool how are we doing on the on the other side of the river oh yeah yeah we've got 17 straw over there cool if we can get through the winter without actually using all of our straw so that we can actually start building up a stock over time that would be freaking staggeringly good it's going down pretty quick, but we're almost through the winter. Not enough storage. Yeah, I know. I know. We're up to 18 knowledge. Trader has arrived. Ah, let's go and try and get rid of some stuff. What can we buy? Um, we could buy some goats. Like, just to get rid of some stuff. You know what? Let's... Let's buy five goats. Uh, we could buy a couple of straw. That's a good idea. We could buy some copper ore. Uh, that I don't want. Right, so 410. What do we get rid of? We've got more food than I... Uh, more cured meat than I want. So let's get rid of some of that for a start. Can I hold it down? No. I've got to individually click. Wow. Uh, no, I can shift click to trade multiples. There we go. Let's get it under 100. Let's get the grain down a bit. Sell some of that. Uh, what else can we sell? I want to sell some stuff to get some stuff out of, out of storage. We could sell... Uh, wool cloth's really valuable, though. Uh, what can I actually sell that would, that would actually free up some space? And the honest answer is there's not a whole hell of a lot, really. Uh, there are a few tools that we could get rid of, but that's, again, doesn't save me a lot of space. I mean, this is only getting rid of stuff out of out of the granary, getting rid of this stuff, uh, which is not necessarily a bad thing. But look, we've got 55 leather now. Wow. OK. Um, let's get rid of some. Let's get rid of some skins, I think. Boom, 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 boom. Um, and then what? We've got wool. We've got let's, let's get rid of some cloth. That'll do. Right. There we go. Sweet. Uh, won't have solved our storage problem, but it's got rid of some stuff and got us a few things that we need, so that's not too bad. All right, let's uh, let's crank up the speed. I really want to see how our how our straw lasts out. Down to thirty nine, thirty eight. Still bringing in odd bits and pieces now and again. We're almost through the winter. 
Oh, a new donkey was born. Right, and look, now we're keeping our animals at that 10 each limit. Perfectly. That's awesome. Sweet. And we've got room for 10 horses when, uh, when the horses are available. Or I could up the limit and maybe increase our goat herd or something like that. Sledge is no longer usable. Fine. Um, now, let's say I built 10 carts. Uh, sorry, I built six carts, didn't I? We need another four carts. Let's get another four carts built. So, one, two, three, four. Cool. Awesome sauce. Um, let's have a, I've, I've got leather set to infinite, I think. Which... Yeah, it's probably not a good idea. Let's uh, drop that down to like, say 30. And the same, let's have skins set at 30. Uh, raw skins, we want as many as we can get hold of. Bones, do we really want an infinite number of bones? And I'm thinking no. So let's drop that down to say 30. All right, uh, mud's fine. Straw, that is infinite. All right, maybe that will help a little bit. Nah, nah. Alrighty. How are we doing now? Yeah, maybe maybe getting a bit better. What are we up to? We're up to 19. We can almost move into the Bronze Age. Oh, we've acquired 100 milk, and that gives us our 20 points. So we can now move to the Bronze Age. Alright. So that opens up copper smelting. Oh no, it requires copper smelting. It opens up tin mines, iron smelting, and all the bronze weapons. Oh man. But the first thing we're gonna do is definitely masonry. Sword making, composite archery. Ho oh, ho, we're definitely gonna want that. And horse domestication. That'll be awesome. So um, yeah, masonry is the next thing that we want. So we can increase the size of our storehouses. Gorza has died of old age. Oh, shame. Shame. Did I? I set up that flint uh, work area, didn't I? Yes, I did. So everything's kind of just ticking along pretty nicely. Hopefully over time we'll, we'll get this stock of wool cloth down because that's kind of really blocking up our, our storerooms. That would give it... If we could get rid of that, it would give us some space. Same with these bones millions of bones um is there, is there anything else we, that we can do with the bones we've i've got the bone harpoons and the bone spears and i'm not making flint spears so yeah we're looking all right let's go let's have a look at what we can do with the copper so what do we want to make with the copper or do we want to actually save the copper and start making bronze weapons because we can now make bronze spears, bronze knives, bronze axes. Yeah, I'm thinking we probably do. In fact, like, do we want flint anymore? Now that's a really good point. Do we do we want to be making all that flint stuff? Well, we're gonna need tin. Now these pit furnace, bronze. So, yeah, do we start making bronze? Good question. So what do we need? We need copper and we need tin. So, yeah. Let's go over here. So let's have a tin mine there and a tin mine there. Cool. Should we set these to higher priority? I think we should. Let's set those to high priority. Five people have joined the settlement, but there's no room for them, so they'll just, I don't know, they'll just have to die or something. Right, how are we doing for stuff? Yeah, oh, look. We didn't bottom out. We didn't bottom out on the straw. And now our straw's up to uh, over 80. Woohoo! Oh my God, we're actually going to be producing more than we've... We're losing. We're low on knives. Now, why on earth would we be low on knives? Crazy. Don't know. Don't know. Uh, how are these mines going on? So, yep. Yep, we're saying mine it. 
you're still building, aren't you? Yep, you're still building. Okay, so let's see if we can't get them. Oh, are you coming in to do a bit of mining? It's brought a brought sledge over here with stuff. I don't know why. Okay. Well, hopefully, hopefully we'll start producing some tin. Let's see. We've got charcoal. We've got copper ore. Oh, we're starting to produce tin ore. Hooray. So now we can start producing bronze stuff. So let's uh, let's get some stuff organized. We want we want to start producing uh, bronze sickles and bronze knives. Uh, do we use bronze picks? I think we probably should use bronze picks. In fact, why don't we just set everything? So boom, 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 boom. Okay, so we'll try and produce bronze tools for everything. Now, does that include uh, does that include harpoons? Then we've got bronze spear, bronze knife, axe, sickle, pick. Okay, so it's basically everything other than the harpoons and the bows. So in that case, let's stop producing uh, flint axe. Let's just stop producing flint tools. Um, actually. Bone, spe bone spears are turn two. What are what are the bronze equivalent? Three, and that's a bronze knife. Three for hunting, two for fighting. So they're slightly better for hunting, but they're not that great for fighting. Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna have bronze spears. So uh, I need to do the same here. Uh, no bronze spears, and we'll continue. To have, I don't know, like what, um, flint spears? Yeah, so we'll continue having flint spears. We'll continue having bone harpoons. We'll continue having bows. And the same here. So turn off the bone spears. Uh, we want flint spears. We don't want the rest of the flint tools. So bows, harpoons, and splint spears. Okay. All right, go. All right. Now, I would think it's going to take some time for us to produce all of these. So in the meantime, since we are low on knives, let's produce a few flint knives. Five and, yeah, let's produce another, another few. Yeah, one, two. Until, just until we can get like our bronze production like fully going. How are we doing? So let's have a look. Oh, um, we're up to nine tin ore. We're up to no, uh, 21 copper ore. Cool. We want this to be a priority and we don't want to produce copper. We just want to produce bronze. Yeah, just produce bronze, please. And I want this to be high priority. Churn it out. Now I think, considering how many tools we need to produce, I think we need another couple of these, don't you think? to keep our metalsmiths going all the time. I mean, I'm thinking at least one more. Let's see, um, we are producing bronze now. I should get rid of this copper because otherwise we're going to be stuck with that. So let's, I don't know, let's, let's crank out some copper spears maybe. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I want you to produce one, two, three, four, actually, I should have I should have made I should have made them copper knives. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's make these copper knives instead of copper spears. Uh, copper knives. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, cool. So that should use up our copper, which helps with the storage, which is a good thing. We've got ten points. Hooray! Masonry, do it. Uh, this unlocks the warehouse, the roundhouse, and the wall. All right, so now we can come over to one of our storehouses and upgrade to a warehouse. Go. Now, let's have a look at you. Hut. Upgrade to a roundhouse. Hell yeah. How are we doing for straw? We're at 59 in the spring, which is awesome. That is awesome. So yeah, let's uh, let's get this going. 
Upgrade. Let's do them like, I don't know, two at a time or something. Upgrade, upgrade. Sweet. Oh, uh, how's the bronze coming in? The bronze is coming in pretty well at the moment. I don't know, do we need another one? I, I don't think we necessarily need another one. Not at the moment. Um, do I want to crank up the bronze storage? I think maybe. Because uh, let's, tw let's have 20 bronze in store. Like, just in case. Why are you all upset, for heaven's sake? What the hell's wrong with you? It's Like, when people die, it upsets the tribe. But it's like natural old age. You should be you should be going, yeah, good for him. He had a good long run. All right, we're bringing stuff in. Building the new houses. Awesome. Building the new storage. All right, so that is getting built. As soon as that gets built, I'll set it to high priority. What the hell? That should give us a bit more room. Yep. Almost done. Come on, come on, do it. Do it, damn it. And there we go, hooray, yeah, so it gives us an extra six slots. Cool, so let's upgrade that one now. And let's, no, I can't. I can't apparently I can't set the priority on that one, why not? Weird. Okay, now, where else have I got? This is a storage as well, isn't it? Yep, that's a storage as well. So I click on that one as well? Yeah, go on, upgrade that one as well. And this is, yeah, upgrade that one as well. All right, sweet. Get all of that done. How is our straw situation? Straw situation, we're at 45. Into the summer with 45 straw. So yeah, our straw is actually gonna start going up. <laughs> that makes me so happy. And look at this. A very cool building. Awesome. Why are all the donkeys in like sticking their heads in there? They're like, what's all this stuff in here? And we've actually got some freaking space now. Unbelievable. Wait till these get built as well. Uh, so there's no upgrades for those. Let's get a couple of these being upgraded. Boom, boom. Now that is going to increase our capacity for the tribe. Because these I'm assuming will, yeah, these are for five people. So we're going to go up from, like, we're currently like 70, what were we, like 73 or something, 76? So, yeah, we're going to add, like, what, like 20, 20, 25 capacity. So we should be able to have get, get the tribe up, heading up towards 100 people, which would be kind of nice. It's one of our pigs running around. Things things are working so nicely. Three goats, three pigs. Yeah, you know what? It, like that limit screen. This really is so crucial. I wish I'd paid more attention to this earlier on. And not that it would have made like a huge difference, but it, it sure as hell makes life easier. We're down to 24 straw. Now I am using straw, obviously, to upgrade these buildings. So, otherwise we'd be we'd probably be still up around the 40 level. But, once we start to harvest, which we are doing now, <laughs> our straw is gonna go up dramatically again. Hell yeah. Oh, this is, this is rocking and rolling. Now, w one thing that I haven't put in is wells. Um, I mean, now we do have a freaking river on two sides of the village. So it's not like desperately, desperately important for us. Um, and we are actually bringing water in. Uh, we've got a water gathering spot here. So, and that's going into our storehouses. So it's actually like really not a big deal. So I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, don't pause. Go faster. Get through the storm. All right, cool. How are we doing? Bronze, we're at 18. How are we doing on the tools front? Answer, we are doing okay. 
We are churning stuff out. Look at this. Eight bronze knives. A bronze spear over there. We've got seven bronze axes now. We've got four bronze sickles. Six bronze picks. We've got a couple of bronze swords even. Woohoohoo! Awesome. Awesome. And we're continuing to churn out this stuff. So, raiders. Ha ha ha! Boy, are they going to be in for a surprise. Oh, oh, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. All right, let's sound the alarm. Speed it up a bit. Okay. Uh, let's... Should we shut the gates? I'm thinking we should probably shut the gates. Yeah, go on. Close the gates. Here they come. And... Oh, they destroyed. They've destroyed two of our... This is the thing. I don't think closing the gates is necessarily a good idea. It doesn't seem to be. Open the damn gates. So our people can actually go out there and fight them. Yeah, we killed them. We lost one of our guys. Yay. And there was much rejoicing. Right. Turn the alert off. So now I've got to rebuild those blooming towers. Right. Well, what do I want? I want my build menu for a start. Towers. That's spiritual. Uh, metallurgy, production, storage, uh, defense. Here we go. <laughs> oh, all over the place. Uh, so, we want a towel there. Towel there. We get. Shame I can't get another tower in. Squeeze another tower in there. Um, could get another tower. Well, I could put another tower there. Yeah, come on, that'll do. Alright, cool. How are we doing? Oh, look at our straw. We're over 100 straw. Oh, sweet. And we've now made 10 bronze knives. And there's loads of straw lying around. Well, there's plenty of room, plenty of room, plenty of room to store it. So, storing our, our straw, not a problem. They just need to get on and do it. Go. But look, there's like loads of grain lying around. Because we're back up to 220 grain again. Wow. Look how much meat we've got. <laughs> Crazy amounts. Oh, here they go. They're bringing this stuff in. What's this? Oh, this is the rock pile. Oh, we've got like tin and copper. Awesome. We could, You know what? We could probably do... Mind you, I was going to say, we could probably do with a, a rock pile over here. But I think, that yeah, that's a rock pile. Unless you've got charcoal in it at the moment. But but they could store other stuff in here. So that's probably okay. Um, meat drying. Tons of meat drying. We're not drying... We're not drying skins. But that's because we're at our production limit. And we shouldn't be making like more wool and wool and clothes. So hopefully they're going down. Uh, where's what? Yeah, look, 41. Excellent. That's going to create loads of storage space. We've got storage space in there. There's, there's, all of the slots are full, but there's still plenty of room for other things. Uh, let's see. That's a warehouse. That's got plenty of room in now. And there's another one over here, isn't there? Yeah. Loads of room in there. So, yeah, we've now got loads of storage. Hooray! And we've got, like... Extra rock pile, extra wood pile, which are not even being used. All right. I've got to say, I think our village is doing pretty well now. Let's carry on upgrading. Upgrade, upgrade. Now, again, how's the straw situation? Oh, we didn't get up quite as high as we did last year. But I think, again, that's probably due to the upgrades. We went... That that point there is where I started the upgrades. We dip down. So yeah, it's just a case of not being too excessive with the upgrades. Or, of course, planting some more stuff. New donkey born. We have survived the winter. We're into the spring again. Still got straw. All right, cool. We are at 10 knowledge. So we can get some more. Now we could do sword making. 
required for composite. Ah, I do want to get to composite archery because I think that would make a big difference. Do we want horses? Do we want horses? Um, I, I think like, what the hell? Let's have horses. Like, why wouldn't you have horses? Beer. Now, beer will cheer people up. So that's uh, required for brewery, baking, and beer. Oh, that's baking. Well, let's get let's get the brewery. Let's get the beer. Now, that, now that's a good idea, Sky. Get some beer going. Yes, this is this is the southwest. I haven't even got any like fruit trees or anything. I've got to say, now they are still working on the game. Obviously, this the, the game is in in beta now, and they're working on the game balance. And I don't know if this scenario is is like easy mode, but I've got to say, it does feel pretty easy. Um, like when you're when you're learning to play the game, it's kind of yeah. But yeah, one of our bread has decayed. That's how much food we've got. Even our bread's decaying now. Right. Uh, so what the hell was I getting? Uh, we want to build. This is going to be production. So we've got. I haven't built any flint. Oh, I did. I build some flint mines. I can't even remember. I don't think I did. Don't really need it though. Our workshop, a place to make miscellaneous tools. Okay, uh, brewery. That's what. This is what we actually want. A brewery. Uh, <laughs> where? I can I get rid of one of these now? What are we making? We're making bone harpoons, flint spears, and bows. But these are all those flint knives, flint picks. Sickles. You know what? Let's get rid of all of that stuff. I'm actually, I'm going to, yeah, get rid of this. Get rid of this one. We'll tear that down and we'll put the brewery in there. It'll help them with, with the praying. It's always good to have a brewery next to where you pray, I think. <laughs> like if you've ever been to church. God. Sit there just dreaming of when you can come out and get a drink. All right, now now that I've offended all of the religious people, oh dear, I'm only joking. Um, I kind of not actually, but hey, uh, brewery. So we can plop a brewery in right there. Do we do we want it facing that way, or do I actually want to flip it around? Be a little bit sensitive. Um, I'm just wondering, like, can it? I don't want to. I don't want to cram it in too tight. Let's just plop that in there. All right. And set it to a high priority. Get it done. Get it done, boys. How are we doing? What's our straw situation? Oh, we've still got like 30. Yeah, good. Good, 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 good. We're in the summer. We've got the donkey carts rolling around. Man, life is good. Life is very good in the village. We're down to six donkeys, though. Why are we down to six donkeys? Horses. Uh, I didn't get the, I didn't do the horse domestication yet, did I? Uh, let me just check. I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Yeah, I think the beer is far more important. Come on, guys, get this blooming brewery built. It's high priority. <laughs> Too darn bloody right it's high priority. Build me my bloody brewery. It's been, it's been like 20,000 years and I haven't had a beer yet. Uh, we're waiting on four logs. Have I actually got any logs? Uh, I don't think we've got any logs. Okay. Where the hell did all our logs go? Uh, let's see. That's a birch tree. Cut that down. Uh, maybe some of these. Yeah, just, just cut all those down. It's fine. And, yeah, and that one. And that one. That'll give us a few. Awesome. And oh, we got a few up here as well. Yeah, chop those down as well. Cool. Right, I'll get a bunch of logs. I should set up probably an area to cut down trees. Yeah, is there? A, yeah, here we go. Cut down trees. If we we crank that up to max size. I'm like we could put it in here or something. Ah, 
I don't know. Do I want to do that? I don't know. Yeah, go on. You know what? I'll put it over there. Trader has arrived. Um, there is there is nothing that I want. <laughs> like this seriously isn't anything that I want as far as as far as I can think. Uh, a horse. Oh, horse domestication. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Let's get that. Save me tech points. Donkeys, a uh, bit of leather, a bit of copper, copper ore. No, I just don't need any of that stuff. So how about? See now I could actually do with that cloth. <laughs> oh man. Uh, but we've got loads of wool outfits, which are worth 10. Uh, let's ship. So we ship a few of those out and ship maybe 10 wool, 10 linen. What's that? And that's 450. Boom. Oh, okay. That was easy. And that gets me horse domestication. All right. Do it. Trade. Woohoo. Oh, look at the, look at the hay going up. Or the straw, I should say. Up, getting well over a hundred this time. Awesome. What I just got, I just got horse domestication, didn't I? I did. So I could get some horses. All right, let's go get some horses. If I can find horses, that is. Are these horses? What horse? Uh, so we want the youngsters. Yes. That's a young female. Young female. Come on, give me a stallion. Give me a stallion. Uh, another young female. That's an adult male, doesn't help. What the hell is that? That's a deer, that's no use. Well, I, I don't think there are, I don't think there are any. At least, not anywhere close by. We'll have to wait for some, some more to migrate in. All right, well, it is what it is. Come on guys, come and get me these horses. But all blooming females, such a shame. Oh yeah, run away from the bear. Don't let the bear eat you. Oh, here we go. And... Yes, we've got our first horse. Woohoo. I'm trying to click on him. Right, pause. Yay, we've got our first horse. Sweet. Now, I don't know whether horses are like automatically used for carts. I've absolutely no idea but we got uh, we got a three sweet seven donkeys three horses so let's see uh 45 yeah so we've got one two three four five six so yeah we've actually got enough to have 10 of each which is what we're set up for at the moment awesome i just need to find one male horse there's no panic we'll, we'll have a look we'll have a look next next spring maybe next summer how did we get how far did we get with the we're up to 124 straw yep it's a new straw record we have surpassed our previous straw record Woohoo! trader let's see what have you got for us you've got three donkeys a bit of straw a bit of bronze some bows so basically nothing that i'm interested in no go away Trading, uh, trading is not the strongest part of this game, you'd have to say. Oh, we're starting to manufacture beer. Ha <laughs> ha, sweet. Now, uh, what did I set? What did I set it up to have beer stored? Fifty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, crack out the beer. I think we probably need another one of these. Now, what do they use? What do they use? Ah, oh, they use grain and water okay that's going to put a bigger strain on our water supply so let's bump you know what uh, yeah all right i tell you what let's have a well uh, we don't need it but actually I, like how am i even going to bother with a well i suppose i'll put one in just so that i've put one in because like that is my job here to show you the game so a well um Boom, in it goes. We've got a well, hooray. Uh, I might even put another one in somewhere. Like if I could like, find some room to put one in. Production, a well. Can I get one? Oh, I can get one in there, there you go. Cool. All right, sorry. What else, what else can we make? 
Uh, anything else in metallurgy? No. Oh, a bloomery. Requires iron smelting. We've already got a couple of metal smiths. A blacksmith for iron smelting. Um, are there any buildings that we can upgrade now? No. Uh, I can upgrade some more houses, I suppose. Let's upgrade a couple of houses. We're up to 71 straw. In the mid... Like, almost at the end of winter. woo hoo hoo, -hoo. Everything's going great. I am loving this. And yeah, let's bump you up to... Uh, let's see what we need. It's only three hay to upgrade. So let's get another couple of those going on. Awesome. A couple of sheep born, donkey born. Survived the winter. We've got five knowledge points. You know what? We're, we're absolutely flying along now. So, guys, we're going to leave it there for this episode. We're in the Bronze Age. Leave me your comments. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Catch you in the next one. Peace out.